Hi folks, Nan Bajani Tierra here. I'm at the pet store. I just saw this high-end dog food spike at 72. Remember what the origin is on this? It says salmon, herring, and flounder. I'm here attempting to buy a bag of dog food. The upper end, the background on air here is typically in the low to mid 50s, so anything above that is uh, unusual. Um, our background today is running um, 34 CPM. It's a little elevated, about three points higher than normal. This uh, dog food company is uh, Canadian based, uh, one of the uh, central or eastern provinces, I can't remember, you guys, I'll, I'll post the website address uh, when I upload the video. This bag is a uh, free range wild boar, lamb, heritage pork and bison, so it's a mix of uh, species, origins. I've not been uh, real excited about buying dog food. I've been in here a number of times with my Geiger counter and um, actually the bag that was lowest last time I was here was this origin uh, chicken, turkey, and wild caught fish bag, but it's elevated today, so um, I'm probably not going to buy it. <laughs> oh, yes, okay, I'm going to move to another bag in particular because my dog is excited. We'll go over here to, uh, this is Natural Balance, um, sweet potato and venison. Boo-boo, <coughs> come over here, sweetie. Papa, come over here. <coughs> Seems like it might be a little lower. I would expect that the longer, the shorter lived animals such as chickens and turkeys aren't, um, doesn't take that long for them to reach maturity. I would expect them to be lower radiation, but um, I haven't watched this long enough to have confirmed or not that personal theory. Natural Bounce does a bunch of specialty foods. The next one is uh, legume and duck. Like I said, I've had a very difficult time buying dog food and feeling good about it. Almost everything I've checked has seemed um, elevated. Now, while, it, while it, this is within the range of a normal background, it's not hovering around our average of 29 to 31 today, 33 CPM. It's actually hovering at the upper end of the range, so I'm pretty confident that these bags are um, elevated. I can't tell you if it's the dog food inside. It's possible that it's on the packaging or uh, dust that's landed on the packaging. but. Um, Again, just thought I'd shoot this for informational purposes. I'm going to shut the video off. It's a little before five minutes. So I don't want to spend my whole evening uploading. But just thought this might be of interest to folks. Again, Nan Bajani Tierra. It's Saturday, July 14th, 2012. I'm, I'm in the specialty dog food store called Fido uh, here in Chapel Hill, North Carolina. Take care. Bye.